Topic 2, Convertible Debt. Convertible debt is a type of instrument where the investor, the creditor, in the debt has the option of converting the debt into shares in the company. Convertible debt breaks down into two categories. Number one, convertible debt where the number of shares issued on conversion is based on a fixed price. Or two, convertible debt where the number of shares issued is based on the market value of shares at the conversion date. The first type has elements of debt and equity. The second is always considered all debt. When looking at convertible debt, convertible at the investor's option, there is with a con fixed conversion price, the proceeds of the issuance, that is the cash received, is split between a liability and equity, where the debt portion is the principal and interest that must be repaid, while the equity portion is the value of the option of the company shares. If the debt issued must be converted, that is, the payment of the principal is settled through a certain issuance of shares, the debt again will be split between a liability and a portion that is the equity. That liability portion is the interest that will need to be paid. The remainder is allocated to equity as it represents the repayment of principal. Let's look at a question. GBC Corp sells $10,000 worth of convertible bonds for $12,000. The bonds pay a coupon of 6% and the market is paying interest at a rate of 9%. These bonds mature in six years. The bonds will convert into 50 shares of JVC stock at maturity. Which of the following, following would be the amount allocated to share equity for the debenture? Would it be A, 2,691? B, 9,309, or C, 12,000. The correct answer is B, $9,309 would be the amount allocated to share equity for the debenture. Let's dig into the journal entry for this um, sale from JBC Corp. In our example, the cash proceeds received were $12,000. The present value of the interest only, using the present value formula for the nominal interest payable, was 2,691. Therefore, if the interest on the liability of the debenture represents, I mean the fair, present value of the interest liability on the debenture is 2,691, the remainder, which would represent the convertible feature as well as the principal payment on this debt would be allocated to the share equity debenture in the amount of $9,309. Thank you and I'll see you in the next video.